What's up guys, this is Alex on behalf of Mako Sports. In this episode of Dope Gear, we're gonna be going over the Clear Tech Spec Cascade S. This is the Clear Exoskeleton version of the Cascade S that Cascade sent to all of their retail stores to demonstrate the new technologies that they put in the helmet. First and foremost, it is important to note that if you ever come across one of these, it is labeled not for play. Uh, these are strictly for display purposes only. If they're not made out of the same plastic that you would have on the field. So if you ever come across one of these, um, don't actually play with it, please, because it will not be the same amount of protection that a normal factory Cascade S would be. First up on the tech spec of it is the vision bar. What this is, is the top bar of the face mask is thinner. It is supposed to increase your sight line and also strength when it's in that shape. Next up is the X-Flow vents. This is probably my favorite bit of the new Cascade S when it came out. Uh, the vents on the top are bigger to give you more airflow, and they also have essentially uh, what I think is an exhaust on the back of it. Really meant to, to let the steam come off your head, and if you know pouring water on your head at practice will cool you off the most, it's because your head is what really conducts all of your heat and your body temperature, so having larger vents on the top of your head helps a, a whole bunch. The most noticeable part of this probably that everybody knows is the jaw piece. And if you notice, it only comes in the, the black part, no matter what, it is called the S-Series jaw. It says, reinforced dual material chin piece that provides improved stiffness. Now they do make stickers that come on top of this so you can make it like chrome gold or anything you want, but uh, it always comes factory black. Next up is probably their most infamous technology, the 7 technology, which I think has been in the Cascade since around the Pro 7. I'll read it off to you. It says, the 7 technology compresses on impact to laterally displace energy, and within seconds, it completely resets placed in key impact zones through the side and rear. They also have the NV3 liner. That goes up on the crown of the head. I'll read you the sticker. It says it is a high performance impact foam that provides maximum protection to the crown of the head. The shell and liner unite with this precisely molded foam that maintains shape and comfort under impact. Lastly, we have the visor and this is not stock. This is actually made by the boys over at Throne Lacrosse. It is their Vision Series. It is a visor specifically made for lacrosse helmets, um, specifically the Cascade R and the Cascade S. The R is a little tricky to get into, it totally works, but it is a uh, glove fit for the Cascade S. So again, guys, thank you for tuning in to this episode of Dope Gear. I am Alex on behalf of Mako Sports. You can follow me at Alex Pool Across on Instagram. If you have any suggestions for our next episode of Dope Gear, drop them below in the comments. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. See you next time. Peace. Ugh. I know if my tilt's not good, they're gonna fucking roast the shit out of me. Alright, we're good. Alright, you ready?